guys hello okay so I just want to do a little reflection video and a discussion on what's going on with my demo account now unfortunately I try to open up I'll try it again because this is just BS until we see some verification I'll try to open my account management with uh, interactive brokers this still is a demo account I'm not unfortunately going to go to a live account straight away um, this is how I did my Forex stuff so I do respect a demo account. I am a certain personality. I'm a little more reserved and conservative. I understand some people, you know, they don't want to do this. They want to jump straight in, but that's just not for me. So right, this is what I'm dealing with here. This is what I'm dealing with. So let's refresh it. I had to open up a live account, but I, I haven't funded it. Not yet. 10 grand US minimum as well. Oh, look at this. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I got authenticated with my phone. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I be key. I be key. Got a winner. No, no. Don't want to win a blank. Alright, this should work now. Good. It's got to load up. Sometimes in the past, it's been successful with this step and then unsuccessful getting to the actual trades hopefully it's good and we can actually see exactly the situation Aussie dollars as well because that's my currency that I will be uh, using in my home country activity activity got an email hot oh, shout out send me a message look out I was gonna do like a presentation, but I just thought uh, we'll just do a word document. We'll just do it raw when it comes in. So, so I don't want to be like too fancy pants. Oh, it's loading. I might take a screeny of this. Uh, God, you this is what happened before. Come on in, after brokers. Anyway. All right, so let's get the calculator out. Let's get the calculator out. Calculator. This will be in US dollars though. Okay, so. Um, all right, so we've got 47 plus 237 plus 60 plus 60 plus 10. Four hundred and fourteen dollars. Okay, so I've got one fifty plus three. I don't know why I moved the, the mouse cursor. Plus sixty again. Hey, popular number. In the wrong way though. Thirty five. One eighty nine. Look, I was better than this. This is that was a shitty trade. One eighty nine. Thirty. And plus 60, really just to. Alright, 934 minus 414, 520. Okay, so that is my situation. So that is negative $520, and I have taken 1, 2, well, 12. Okay, so I've taken 12 trades. So, look, that's not. It's not a good situation, really, with with the five winning or four winning, and then seven losing or two, four, six, eight, eight losing trades, four winning trades, so thirteen trades. Sorry, because twelve to four, and that's okay. So that's the situation. So now it comes to what am I going to do about it? So we're in the whole five hundred twenty dollars. That's US actually, from my understanding. So that's five percent. 5.20% drawdown. So to me, that's a concern. I don't really, that's not a good situation, especially recently. I've had a, quite a few losing trades. I think the last, uh, I believe it has been the last two trades at least have been losing. I think this 189, this one was before it, after it, sorry. So maybe not. Maybe it is three losing trades in a row. 
So these two are this week. And look, the ones in orange really highlight issues. That, so the one, two, three that, you know, haven't happened again. And as you can see, I have cut losses a lot quicker. But as, as you, uh, you the, the negative 60, that, that should have been a lot less. But, you know, I just didn't execute fast enough and it fell a little bit quicker so if we go to the recap uh yeah so it actually went to 393 and it fell on me pretty was it dramatic i was just not quick enough so i you know i and i was sort of holding it even though it was it was going sideways for a little bit of time it did actually end up breaking again that day but it's a timing thing so i my timing was off and you know, you move on from that and you quickly get out. You don't hold and hope. So what am I doing to help uh, navigate around these issues that I've got? All right, so uh, let's get a Word document. Word. All right. Okay, okay, okay. I was going to do this beforehand, but I've made a couple other videos to do with um, some currency trading that I do as well. Let's, let's make this like, what do we want to make it? 24. Number one, define my trading plan. Okay, so what I've sort of looked at with this trading journal is that obviously I'm more in a buying than selling. So I am fully aware that you've got to adapt and that I understand that. So what I do like though is breakouts of strong uh, resistance levels. If if price is trending into uh, a level, it's a resistance level, and if it's going down, it's into a support level. So um, let's see how many selling mistakes I can make. Uh, to find my trading plan, I favor breakout trades. I think I'm just going to keep it like that. Okay. So this this is really reinforced. Uh, this was a trade I did last week on this uh, SPWH and it was 189. So what what happened there was I just sort of let it go well into another support level and it was just reckless trading because once it's done that, once a move like that is made, it's quite difficult psychologically for me. So I find, you know, I naturally don't have like a stubborn nature and I want to I want to cut losses quickly so and I mean to, to some people that that trade I don't know what your comfort level is for a loser it might be five percent a trade but for me it's really around one percent you know so around a hundred dollars And that will be based on my risk to reward as well. So if it's a two to one, it's obviously going to be 60. And if it's like a four to one, it's obviously going to be. I'm going to try and be as coherent as possible. It was quite a big day today. I started work at six in the morning. Yes, I know it's the weekend. I work at the airport here at Perth. And um, it was just an eight-hour day, but then I did other things. I went to the gym after and 
Um, I was just rolling on caffeine most of the day. <laughs> and I'm up and at him tomorrow as well, Sunday, and then I'm working the whole week as well, Monday to Friday. So, you know, I'm saving up for the trading challenge. All right, I don't want to keep this video too long and blah, blah, So, all right, so to find my trading plan, I've had breakout trades. Be picky. Don't trade shit setups. All right, and number three, don't risk too much per position. All right, so those are the three rules, guys, I'm going to stick with for now. Thank you for watching, and stay tuned. I'll discuss a few more things uh, tomorrow as well. Bye.